Hello fellow Pokemon trainers and fans, Prince Charmer here and we're back for episode number 3 of our Pokemon Fire Red Randomized Nuzlocke Let's Play. <laughs> I was like, oh, where am I going with that? <laughs> but, um, thank you guys for joining us. If you missed out on the last episode, what are you doing? Go check it out. I have the playlist set up on my channel so you can go ahead and catch up on episode 1 and 2. Episode 2 was really good. We took on Eddie, our rival, and we also added a few new team members. Um, let's see. Let's take a look at those said team members. We have, first off, Littlefoot the Bailey. Level 9. We caught Bailey at, uh, Bailey? Bayleaf, excuse me. <laughs> Littlefoot. We caught him at level 4. I went ahead and I did some grinding off screen, so you're welcome. We didn't waste like 10 minutes of the first episode trying to level Bay Bayleaf up, trying to level up Littlefoot. So I went ahead and, uh, you'll, you'll see the grinding montage that we did, um, for the first minute or minute and a half of the episode. So Bayleaf is at level 9 uh, with Overgrow. Pinches, uh, blah, I can't talk today. What is wrong with me? Uh, raises grass type moves uh, when HP is like, I think it's a, a third or lower. So with Tackle, uh, Growl, Razor Leaf, and Reflect. Then we have Ares, our starter, the Magmar with Ember, Leer, Smog, and Fire Punch. And Sea Biscuit. Yes, Sea Biscuit. You're not reading that wrong. I misspelled it. Okay. Let's get. Let's just move on. <laughs> so we have Seabus Cut, the uh, water gunning, growling, singing, and mist uh, inducing Lapras. So uh, we caught Littlefoot over there in the Viridian Forest, which means we didn't get that far in it. Oh, I'm going back in the Pokemon Center. So today uh, I'm gonna try and hurry. Uh, I want to get. I want to get through the Viridian Forest. I don't know if we'll be able to take on Brock, but you know what? Let Let's see. Let's Let's hope and pray for progress. So let's go ahead. Um, I'm really excited because, like I like I've been saying, I can't I can't stress it enough, guys. It feels so good to just know that I'm playing through the game. I don't have to worry about any bugs or crashes, and we can just we can enjoy it together this journey. So uh, I like I said, I haven't played Fire Red in quite some time. Uh, so I'm really excited. Uh, we already got the item over there. The item over there. I won't spoil it. Um, Go, go check out the last episode. It's, it's like in the last five minutes or so when we caught Littlefoot. So, hey, please, please do it. Do it. It's worth it, I promise. <laughs> All right, so let's see. Um, normally, there's bug Pokemon in here, so I would be a little shaky leading with Littlefoot. But, hey, it's randomized. Who knows where we're going to run to? It, it might be all water Pokemon that we get. So let's see. Elite, Elite Force Zoe. Eladios? That's not fair. It's really not fair because watch, it's gonna use momentum. I bet you. Oh, never mind. I lied. It used wish. Um, or is it memento? I can't remember. There's a move where Latias and Latias. No, Latios and Latias. I, I, I don't know what's wrong with me. They'll learn a move uh, early on. It's like one of their starting moves. It's called memento, and um, they'll they'll just kill themselves to lower our attack and special attack. So it's really lame when you run into them at such a early level. Oh my goodness, this is gonna take. It's gonna take so long. Oh, don't tell me all it knows is wish. I really don't want to speed up. I don't want to use the speed up button, but I'm feeling like we're gonna have to. Because tackle's not doing anything. You know, side wave? Okay. Never mind. Let's just use Raider Leaf. Hopefully we can get a crit. Um, it's special in this gen. Oh, there's a that was a critical hit. Oh my goodness. Alright, so. So much for making progress. I, I I feel like this is gonna go on forever. Okay, we're gonna call it the big guns. Go see Biscuit. We're gonna try and put this Latios Latios to sleep. Side wave. I think side wave is one of like the lame uh, first gen moves because it's psychic, but it has like varying degrees of damage. It can do a lot or it can do a little. It's all random. So like, see, the first time I did eight, now I did seven. Come on, Seabiscuit, sing! We need you to sing! Okay, see, like, it's doing less and less. Yes! The sing hit. Okay. Um. And I know Latias is really specially defensive, so. And I don't have any physical attackers. Like, no physical moves aside from tackle on Littlefoot. But who knows what, what his, uh, his attack is. Alright, who has a special attack highest? Okay, so uh, blah, blah, blah. special attack highest. I can't. I cannot speak today. <laughs> um, we have uh, 24, 24, 25, 23, 19, 17. Okay, so it looks like 
Ares is going to be our best bet. I mean, it's like one point higher, but he does have a stronger move. He has Fire Punch. That's like a base... I want to say his big base 70. I'm not too sure. But, um... Let's go ahead. Hopefully... Come on, Ares. Big damage. Wow, come on! Just stay asleep. Stay asleep, Latias. Stay asleep. On the plus side, we're faster than Ladia, so... If it wakes up... Oh, don't use Wish. No! Stop using Wish! Oh, you frustrate me to no end! Come on! Come on, Ares! Get a crit! Get a crit! Ah, oh, get a burn! Get a burn! Get something! Use Wish again, so now it's gonna... It's gonna earn its HP back! No! Please don't... Oh, it's back in the green! I'm not gonna panic. I'm just gonna try and remain calm. Maybe we can get a burn. Okay, use side wave. Use side wave. We have a chance. We have a chance because even if he uses wish. Oh, is that it? Oh, okay. It, di it didn't use it. Alright. Perfect. Because I was gonna say, even if he used wish, there's no way it was gonna get his HP back. And down goes the Latias. Wow, you were a pain in the butt. Everyone's getting 90 experience across the board. That's great. Pupitar. Alright, so. Littlefoot. It's all on you, buddy. So, a uh, Razor Leaf should take it out in one hit. I don't think it has Sturdy or anything like that. Pupita. Oh, I would love to get a... No, you know what? Never mind, L.I. Because, like I said, we don't have the National deck. So, if we were to get a Pupitar or a Larvitar, they would not evolve. Our best hope is a Tyranitar. Ooh, can you imagine getting a Tyranitar? I can imagine, and I'm liking it. Wow, that was a lot of XP. All right, thank you, Elite Trainer Zoe. I mean, Elite Trainer. Elite 4, Zoe. Alright, so let's see. Let's stay out of the grass. Um, there's really no reason to be in the grass. Because we already got an encounter. And, you know, it's randomized. So, if we're going to lose a Pokemon, I want it to at least be in a battle. Hopefully, we don't lose a Pokemon. Oh, a Chansey! No! What is with all these walls? <gasps> okay. Let's see. Let up, oh, why is everyone missing? First we had and those pound and those pound. Okay. Um You know what I can do? Ares has leer. Poison is physical in this gen. So we'll just leer 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 and then use smog. I don't think this chance it can do any wow, that was a crit. Okay. All right. Let's go ahead. Hopefully this works. Oh, and it's growling now to negate it. Chansey, 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 baby, darling. Why you do this to me? Come on, don't use Growl. Okay, let's use Impound. Another crit! What the heck? <gasps> Alright, we got the burn. Sweet! Alright, so let's use one more Leer. And, um... I'm just gonna go for a Smog. You know what? I'm gonna... I'm gonna test my luck. I want to see what it what a fire punch would have done okay you know what never mind i think smog is the way to go so let's let's see so we know that fire punch our strongest special move didn't do anything to that chancy i used three layers already we have a growl working against us but i'm pretty sure this smog should take out and if it doesn't the burn will okay maybe not maybe or you know what maybe the burn will come on I have no words. <laughs> oh my goodness, these walls. I need to get Chris Jericho in here. Break the walls down. Littlefoot, wow, Littlefoot, buddy, you need to calm down. You are gaining so much experience. And uh, I checked on uh, Bulbapedia. Normally, um, you know, when, when uh, ooh, a Whalmer, that's going to be a delicious experience. So Littlefoot, oh my goodness, you're going to be like level 14 by the time we get to the gym. Uh, Littlefoot is going to learn all the moves he would as a Meganium. So even though, like, once we finally evolve at, who knows when, like, level 65, um, all his moves, we won't miss out on any moves. That's that's what I'm trying to get at. He'll learn all his level up moves um, as a Bayleaf that he would as a Meganium, except he'll learn them a lot faster. So that's, I mean, that's kind of good. We have that working in our favor. So Wailmer goes down. Littlefoot needs to, like, chill. I'm kind of wishing we had our, uh, we had D's hands. Bellsprout. D's hands would have made it so much easier on Chansey. Uh, not so much with Latias. Because, you know, it's psychic. And those side waves would have hurt a lot. 
Let's go ahead and let's fire punch this uh, poor little bell sprout into oblivion. And down it goes. So we're already what we're looking at. We're looking at close to 10 minutes and we barely mm, scratched the surface of the Viridian Forest. Okay. We're taking on Brock. We're taking on Brock. I'm making it my priority to take on Brock today. Ooh, an item. Let's find out. What do we get? A white herb. I forgot what that does. We'll check it once we get to Pewter City. I think that um that'll clear a status ailment. So like say for example we have a uh a Dragonite and Dragonite use Outrage. After Outrage uh confuses it after two or three turns, it's all random. <gasps> oh Rayquaza! Why? Why is this happening to me? Where the mm, Okay, calm down, calm down. Uh alright, let's uh let's take it slow. It's flying at Dragon, so Rage Leaf is not gonna do anything. Let's set up a reflect. Maybe Littlefoot. Littlefoot, I think you're gonna be the best one to do this. Oh my god, that stab and oh, it's Rayquaza. Okay. Let's growl. We're gonna growl and reflect. We're gonna we're gonna take down this Rayquaza. Or Rayquaza, whatever you wanna call it. I don't care. It's a giant dragon. It's Shenron. Shenron is here and I am scared. You who had summoned me for these dragons. Oh, it's now it's lowering my speed. Great. Okay. But like I was saying, back to the white herb. <laughs> I get derailed so easily when I get scared. Uh, the white herb will clear that confusion up. Or if you use, um, if you get burned or if you get um, paralyzed, anything like that, it clears it up. I didn't see, do we have another, do we still have reflect up? I think after this turn, reflect uh, will go down. So we'll set up a reflect. Um, okay, so yeah, reflect is down. Let's go reflect. And then uh, I'll use a potion. I'll use a potion to uh, get Littlefoot all the way back up. And then we're just going to tackle away. We're going to tackle and tackle. And uh, we're going to go ahead. And we're going to win. We're going to win. I know it. Okay. So I'm, I'm really I'm really liking Littlefoot right now. Littlefoot. Come on. Come on. Tackle. Whew, let's see how much this does. Come on. Okay, that's decent. That's decent. It might take us another potion um, to, you know, take down this Rayquaza. We flinched? Twister can flinch? I had no idea. Alright, you learn something new every day. Come on, little foot. I believe in you. Let's make our way to the Great Valley. Our Reflect is already gone? Oh my god. Alright. Oh no, I didn't want to switch. I just wanted to check on Lapras. Okay, see Biscut. Let's see. I mean, the, the attack is still down. Okay, so that didn't do, didn't do too much. Uh, let's maybe we can put it to sleep, or maybe we'll miss. Come on, Lapras. See Biscut. Give us a beautiful lullaby. I just realized all the people, all the people, all the mons on our team—they're all, uh, they're all boys. We got an all-male squad going on. Sing! Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I don't even know what else is in this forest. Who knows? See, this is what makes a randomizer fun. It's just... You never know what's going to happen. Woo! I'm starting to think I should have just switched out into... Um, to Ares again. Because, like I said, he has the, the strongest special move out of all our guys. Plus, his special attack is sky high. He has fire punch. Wow, that didn't do anything! Oh my goodness! Alright, let's try Ares. I'm like testing fate right now because I'm switching all around. I'm playing really recklessly right now. Come on, Ares, take it. Eat it. Okay, uh, I'm scared because if he crits us, we're done. And I do not want to lose Ares. I am not losing Ares this early on in the Nuzlocke. <sighs> my heart is racing! Okay, come on. Fire punch! Fire punch! Get a burn! Get a crit, get something. See, look at that. That's perfect. We should have just done that from the beginning. Whew. Okay, I'm not thinking straight. It's just I see a legendary Pokemon and I get scared. I wouldn't mind having a Rayquaza on the team. I would totally use a Master Ball on it. So Ares gets to level 11. Do we learn anything new? Sea Biscuit, 109. Town Dower. Oh my goodness. Oh, and Sea Biscuit's like at medium health. Whoo! We're going to have to go back to the Pokemon Center, or to the Pokemart. We're going to go to the Pokemon Center, we're going to heal up, 
And, uh, we gotta buy more potions. One hit KO. One hit KO. Perfect. Alright, so Hand Hour's down. Sea Biscuit, getting up to level 11 too. Making some nice progress. I think we'll be... I think we'll be okay if we get to the if we get to Peter City, we'll be able to uh, take on Brock. I'm pretty sure because our team's pretty well balanced. I wish we had the running shoes so bad. This will make this so much faster. Wait, 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 wait. How many potions do we have? We only have one potion left. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna use it on Sea Biscuit. Oh my goodness. And you know what? What's your special attack looking like? I just want to plant 29. Wow. 29 special attack. Um, yeah, Ares, you're going to be leading the party today. If I can uh, figure out the button configurations. There we go. Do, 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 do. I remember in the original game, these trees were actually like cut tree stumps. And I could have sworn that there was a way to get like a Scyther. I thought there was a Scyther in the Viridian Forest. Because it, it only made sense. Scyther has like those big old Baraka hands. <laughs> and he, it, it, like, all the cut trees, what do you think? I put two and two together. Another Elite Four member, Crystal. And I'm so glad we led with Ares. Ares! Fire Punch! Boom! Boom! Way to go, Ares. I'm, I'm liking Ares. I, I mean, I've always, like, had a soft spot for Magmar. He's, I thought he was really cool. But, uh, this Nuzlocke, <laughs> it's, uh, increasing my love for Ares even more. So let's see. Let's go for a shadow, uh, I was gonna say a shadow punch, a fire punch. Fire punch, one hit KOs that jump it. Awesome, Ares. It's not that serious. Just kidding, yes it is. 31, so wow, he's getting a lot of, <laughs> like, special attack boost. Uh, so we're gonna go ahead and let's stay with Mankey. Let's stay in against that Mankey. You wanna fight? Let's fight. I'll throw a fire punch your way. Boom. Aries. Oh my goodness. What time is it? What time is it right now? Okay, we're getting close to like a 20 minute episode, but I want to take on Brock. I want to take on Brock. And a fun fact, the day this is going up, like the day I'm recording this, it's it's not my birthday. But the day it's going to be up, it's going to be a Wednesday upload. It will be my birthday. <gasps> Ooh, a great ball. All right. Um... Oh my goodness, today's a special, you know what, yeah, we're gonna do it. Today's a special day. Today is the day of my birth. The day I, uh, came into this world. And we're gonna take on Brock. We're gonna do it, we're gonna make a half hour episode. If I can get there in time. If we can take out this one last Elite Four. Why are they all Elite Four members? And why do you have a Mighty Enna? That's not fair. Woo, but then again, I have, an, I have, a, I have a Magmar. I have an Ares the Magmar. Fire puncha! Ah, oh, that was so close to being a one-hit KO. I would have been like, wow. Damn. But still. So we got Mighty Enna going down to Ares, the god of war. And you know what? We did it. We're gonna do it. I'm excited. I'm pumped. I am like ready to go. And I'm shaking the camera. I don't care. I'm sorry. <laughs> so let's go ahead. We're gonna. Uh, route two. We already caught route our route two encounter. That was that was Dez Hands. I have a problem with m misspelling nicknames. I don't know why. Someone pointed out to me that I spelled D's wrong. I'm not gonna name any names. <coughs> Baby Umber. <laughs> um, but uh, like I said, we have a name reader, and I'll, th I'll definitely change his name. But I'm kind of growing uh, fond of Seabis Cut. So okay, so we healed up our mons. We just gotta go to the mart really fast and let's pick up some potions because we're gonna need them. Cause who knows what this what this first gym is gonna hold in store for us. Yes, I would like to be helped to some po What? We only have four hundred dollars? And as you can see, a potion's three hundred. So we're going in with only one potion. Okay, let's see. Let's see if we can get rid of some stuff. We definitely want that antidote. Can we sell that tiny mushroom? What's that tiny mushroom going to give us? 250? Okay, I'd rather get 250 bucks. Wider? 50 bucks? Are you serious? Whoo! Can I get something for the Master Ball? Oh, no, I can't buy that. Nope. Great Ball? Oh, but I want to keep the Great Ball because what if, what if we need it? All right, so I guess we can only buy... We can only buy one more potion. All right. I mean... 
we can take on the what oh there's only one gym trainer in Brock's gym so we're not gonna get that much money again what would be amazing is if we could find an amulet coin and give that to one of our Pokemon to hold and that way we get double the bucks or I don't know if it's double or if you just get like an increase like a 1.5 uh, multiplier to the money you earn but yeah that would definitely help all right so since the abyss cut is at level 11 we'll go ahead and um, we'll lead with him let's see who's this guy Hiya! do you want to dream big do you want to dare to dream of becoming the Pokemon champ I am no trainer but I can advise you on how to win let me take you to the top sure why not all right let's get happening the first Pokemon out of the match is at the left of the Pokemon list. By changing the order of Pokemon, you can make gain an advantage. Try different orders to suit your opponent's party. You didn't even tell me about Brock. Normally, they'll tell you about the gym leader and like what Pokemon he has. All right, so let's take on this little kid. Stop right there, kid. You're 10,000 light years from facing Brock. We got a long way to go then. So yeah, you know what? That's what I'm going to do. Um, I'm going to try and take on every gym trainer before we take on the gym leader. Corfish! Take out a corfish. Sorry, that was like really random. Let's see if we can sing. All right, see Biscuit landing the sing on the first one. Please do that for the gym if we need it. Um, so corfish's water water gun is not gonna do squat to it. So Littlefoot coming to the rescue again. Littlefoot, it woke up and it used Harden. Okay, well that's not too big of a deal because like I said. Razor Leaf is special in this gen. So it should be a one hit KO. And if not, more than likely we'll get a crit. Super effective. Alright, Corfish is down. Look at that. And we don't even have to go back to uh, heal at the Pokemon Center or anything. Littlefoot is level 13. Volbeat. Oh, wait a minute. I thought, that we, I thought we were done. <laughs> uh, let's switch into Ares. I don't want to go back and uh, heal up. I want to just go in there and destroy Brock. Or get destroyed by Brock. Hopefully not the latter. We want the former. Fire Punch! Boom! Oh, that poor Volbeat. Oh, a single hit takes it down. Throw back to Pokemon Stadium. I really want a game like that. Just like... I mean, we have it with the current gen games. I know I said this in like my Soul Silver LP. But that would be so much fun if they could just have like an announcer during, the, during our 3D battles. Alright, so we got... 200... 220. Mm, we could go get another potion, but I'm going to hold on to it. So let's go ahead. All right, guys, we're going to take on Brock. This is it. Woo! If you're excited, please tell me in the comment below if you think we're going to get destroyed by Brock or if we're going to just crush him to dust. Huh, so you're here. I'm Brock. I'm Pewter's gym leader. My rock hard willpower is evident even in my Pokemon. My Pokemon are all rock hard. And I have true grit and determination. That's right. My Pokemon are all the rock type. <laughs> You're going to challenge me knowing that you'll lose? Hey, no, I didn't say that. I asked the comments if they said that. That's the trainer's honor that compels you to challenge me. Fine then. Show me your best. Oh, this music. I love the gym leader music so much. Okay, I'm gonna stop. <laughs> oh my goodness, the nostalgia. Servant Joey, he sends out an Ella kid. And what do we leave with? We live with Sea Biscuit, right? Dang! And I'm pretty sure it knows like Thunder Shock or it's probably knows Thunder Punch because Aries knows Thunder Punch. Okay, let's switch into Littlefoot because I know it's gonna be resistant. And Littlefoot is just like our safety net. We oh he's carrying the team on his back. So use quick attack. All right, shouldn't do too much. Let's go ahead and use our razor leaf. Hopefully we get a crit. We can knock it out because I know Elekid's special is pretty high too, even though it is a baby Pokemon. But razor leaf, this should take it out. All right, one down, one to go. Please don't be something outrageous. See, Biscuit grew to 130. Uh, grew to 135. Gained 135. Little got 135. Slack off. Woo! All right, we got this in the bag. Let's go ahead and we'll, let's let Seabiscuit do some work. Because I don't think Seabiscuit's done too much today. So let's go ahead and let's have her, him, sorry, gender, <laughs> mix up, him win the match. Level 14 slack off. Let's go ahead and use Water Gun. So this match is pretty much in the bag because what it... Oh, 
don't, don't yawn. Why? Huh, because Slackoth has an ability called Truant. And that means that every other move, or every other move, every other turn, it can't attack. So use Yawn. If I were to attack right now and stay in with Sea Biscuit, we'd fall asleep. We'd get a free attack, but it's not worth it. Let's just go ahead. Oh, you know what? I should have switched into Ares. But you know what? Uh, I guess it's my subconscious. I really like Littlefoot. Because you know what? Everyone... Oh my goodness, Yawn. Like, I don't think it's even attacked us this whole time. But that's okay. That's okay, because one Razor Leaf, and it's done. Unless we would have missed. In which case, the battle would have been a little bit longer. But we did it, guys! We took him out! With that, we have gained our first gym badge in Kanto! The Bolter Badge. Woo! We defeated Servant Zoe! Huh, I took it for granted, and so I lost. As proof of your victory, I confer on you this. The official Pokemon League Boulder Badge. We got the Boulder Badge from Brock. One down, seven to go. Alright, let's see what Brock has to say. Just having the Boulder Badge makes your Pokemon more powerful. It also enables the use of F Move Flash outside of battle. Of course, a Pokemon must know the Move Flash to use it. And we got some big bucks! Woo! 1400! Wait, take this with you. TM39! What is that? A TM, technical machine, contains a technique for Pokemon. Using a TM! I'm gonna yawn, I don't know why. Teaches the move it contains to a Pokemon. A TM is good for only one use, though. So when you use it, pick the Pokemon carefully. Anyways, TM39 contains how? Aw, oh, dang it! So yeah, like Brock said, TMs in this game are one use only. So if you are used to playing the old, I mean the old, the newer games, like uh, I think Black and White was the one who introduced it. Black and white and like Gen 6, TMs are multiple uses. You can use it as many times as you want. I really wish we got like the TM that he originally gave us because that would have been a lot more useful. Hal just raises our attack. It That's all it is. It's just like Swords Dance, but it's only by one stage, I think. And if he would have given us the regular TM, it would have been... Um, what would it have been? I think it's Rock Tomb. Yeah, it's, it's Rock Tomb, which would inflict damage to Rock-type move, as the name suggests. And it lowers the speed of the Pokemon, so that would have been really useful. I, I would have much rather have had Rock Tomb than, than Hal. But that's going to wrap it up for today's episode, guys. We went through the Virian Forest, we took out Brock, and we got our first Gym Bash. And after, uh, after that, what are we going to do? Well, I'm pretty sure we're going to make our way through Mount Moon and get to Cerulean City so we can get our second Kanto Gym Badge. So as we finish healing up our Pokemon, I want to say thank you guys again for coming out. Uh, leave a like, leave a comment, let me know what you enjoyed about this video. And if you are interested in seeing more and uh, want to be alerted whenever we put up a new episode, whether it's Pokan, whether it's our Fire Red Leaf, uh, Fire Red Leaf Green, Fire Red LP, or any other content, subscribe so that way you can uh, be a part of my community. So thank you again, guys. Take care, and I'll see you next time. Bye.